Mm, check this gun out. That shit is hot, son! Are we gonna kill people with it? Pew pew! Dum to death, yeah. To death. That's <laughs> usually what kill me. Pew pew! <laughs> when are we gonna kill people? I don't know, what do you want to? I don't know, but we gotta go get some Pepsi products. 99 cents. 99 cents? 99 cents for Pepsi products. Pepsi products. Oh my god, I'm so bored. Doesn't that guy that on that live show worked for Pepsi? The one on Friday nights? Oh, that, those middle-aged dudes that collect comic books, they all got those neck beards, and they're all judgmental about comic books? Yeah, I think one of them works for Pepsi. I think so too. Speaking yeah. of those guys, they're having a contest. Kind of contest. I don't know. I, th I thought it was some TikTok BS, but no. Apparently, if you answer like the seven questions, right, you live in the United States or Canada, because let's be honest, that's just America. And you're 18 or over, which I think would qualify. And uh, I mean, we're sitting in a garage, yeah. you know, reading the newspaper and magazines yeah, that's on pretty... a Saturday night. Yeah. So I think we're old enough. Yeah, I think we're old enough too. Um, and, and you basically you make this video. I, I don't really want to make the video, dude. Let's just, but they do have some cool questions. You want to run through them? Yeah, sure, why not? I got 30 minutes to kill. Let's kill 30 minutes. I, 30 I wrote minutes. them down already for you. Did you write them down? I wrote them down. All of them? I thought this was interesting. All right, let me get in my relaxed state here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So All the right. first question is, you have a path you must walk down. If you will. What kind of path? The, the yellow brick road, if you will. Okay. And in it, there's a fork, and you must follow the path of the Jedi or the path of the Sith. What do you choose? There's no, like, Star Trek Vulcan stuff? Well, I just gave you your option. Look, man, <laughs> this is too hard. I'm going to go with Sith because they make more money. I like that idea. I'm going to go with Sith because. Jedi's are just weird. They're always like together, sitting around in a circle, yik yakking about morals or some BS to each other. And the Seth dude, like, like Darth Vader, you didn't see him like chilling out with a bunch of dudes. No, he was kind of hanging out by himself. Yeah, and then most bang. of the time, then like choke people. That was kind of cool. <laughs> Next one is, is you have a choice, right? You get to read comic books for the rest of your life, but your choices are Image and every other indie comic book, or Marvel or DC? Garfield. I think that's actually Marvel while you're joking. Well, then I'll go with Marvel and DC. I'm going to go with Marvel and DC too because let's be honest, there's just some really weird stuff in the indie world that I don't want to get stuck reading. <laughs> Next question. All right. You have to, you're, you write for comic books. Okay. Right. Don't need a whole lot of qualification these days. But you get sure. to write for it. And you get to pick which artist you want. Right? Now you get two options. Jim Lee. You get two options. Todd McFarlane. And here they are. <laughs> you get Peach, Momoko, Frappe Lape, Crappiola. Who? Peach, uh, Peach Momoka. Momoka. Or does she know her name is Peach? Is it a she? I don't. I don't know. I don't know. These or, days. Or you get Rob Liefeld, the Deadpool guy, the guy who drew Deadpool. I'm gonna choose Rob Liefeld because all you have to do is like pay him in cocaine, and he'd be good. That's true. I don't want to hang out with. I somebody. don't even know who Peach Momoko is. I don't want to hang out with somebody that sounds like they're named after a Starbucks drink. Fair enough. Fair enough. Okay, fourth question. Alright? So you get to be the manservant, right, of a group of people. Those groups Count of these angels. Those groups of people are the teenage I don't mutant like this ninja. Content. The who? The teenage mutant ninja turtles. With April O'Neil? Sure. Or the the mighty morphic power rangers. Now, what are my duties exactly? Manservant. Look, I've been I've been a manservant to many animals in my time. I'm gonna have to go with the Power Rangers. See, I'm gonna have to go with the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. 
Because whenever I talk to somebody, I don't want them to have to do this all the time. Bro, easy, buddy. E bro, easy. What, what was that? Bro. It's that dance from the 90s. Uh, next. The evasion comes, but you get to pick the evasion you get to, that you get to try to survive, if you will. One is the Xenomorphs from Aliens or Predator from... Predator? Predator. <laughs> the Predators are the ones that look... They have the face like the vagina with the scorpions coming yeah, out of all. it. it's all. Like scorpions coming out of a vagina? Yeah, it's all. <laughs> they are way too smart. I'm going to have to go with the Aliens. We have to go with aliens too, because that's like they look like bugs. So I'm thinking like a can of raid. Cut that. A out. big can of raid. Big can of raid. Can you make that? We a can big... make a big can of raid. That would be awesome. All right. Next, you get to be with, lay with, marry, your choice. Tila from Masters of the Universe or Shatara from Thundercats. Oh. Oh. I've never had a hairball. I think I'm going to have to go with Chitara. <laughs> I'm going to have to go with Chitara too because a red-headed veteran female that's all butch, I'm not trying to hang with that. Plus, I've dated a redhead before. You know what she did to me? No, what? She stabbed me. Why? Redhead. Fair enough. Fair enough. Next. And this is kind of a weird question. I think that they're, they're fishing for compliments or something. I don't know. But you get to spend an entire day with one of these cats, right? Are we talking about yeah, Huey? Chitara? No. You no. said cats. Yeah. No? I, I talk like an old man. Just be quiet and listen. <laughs> Huey's comics. Who? Spectacular Spider Grandpa, which is way too long of a name. Who? And Pokan Joe. Who? I don't know. That sounds like the manliest one to me. And these guys are on YouTube. Yeah, they're YouTube famous. <laughs> How long have they been on YouTube? I don't know. Five years. Nobody Five. watches the show. It don't matter. Do <laughs> so they got a lot of subscribers? Sure. What, what's a lot? 500? Sure. <laughs> All right. Um... I'm going to have to go with Huey's Comics just because it sounds the most feminine. The name Huey sounds feminine to you. It does. Okay. I'm going to have to hang out with that Pokan Joe guy. Because that seems like the kind of guy that drinks. And I can always Does Huey drink? drink? Maybe mayonnaise. What? Can I re re Can I take my pick back? I say we shouldn't even bother doing this content. All right. Go back to doing old man shit. All right. Um, onions are on sale. The Dahlia onions. onions. Bulk or tote bag? Ninety nine cents. Price low every day. <laughs>